I remember when I was younger, probably like a few years ago, I came outside one day at like 5.15 in the morning. This was in mid-June. This was right near the summer solstice or whatever when it was when it was really light out. It was the longest day of the year. Dude, it was so bright at 5.15. I couldn't believe it. I don't even know why I was out. I think I was doing some bullshit video trying to fake something or something. I was like, I'll go out at 5.15 so people will believe me. And it was bright as shit. No, but honestly, this right now it's like six o'clock in the morning, guys. I this is I wake up at like five thirty-six. I don't. I could probably go to sleep at like one a.m. So this is pretty normal for me. This is the type of sleep that I get. I I don't know why, but I I, I seem to function pretty well on it. Guys, I don't know what it is. I'm trying to make a bet right now. I I, I literally. Anytime I try and go on to one of these sites, whatever it is, like FanDuel, like, you know, it's, it's all legal now in my state, but they won't verify me. I enter in everything correctly. They will not verify me. Are you kidding me, honey? Honey, that's not going to do anything. You're just resetting it. You're, you need to help me. How should I respond to this? I... My, I, I don't even know how to respond to this at this point. Hold on. I need this woman to go in and fish physically. You, you need to go. Honey, you just gave me an automated response. You didn't even read what I said. Oh, come on. You're not typing that fast. This is a bot. It says it's this woman and it's fake. It's a joke. It's a bot. Let's see. what. Maybe this is a, okay. She's typing. She's typing. But guys, there's, listen, the draft right now, I think there's a great opportunity to bet on the number one pick. I'm trying to actually get into an account to actually bet it. Yeah, I've looked. I literally have my ID right here. Well, guys, it turns out it, it doesn't even matter if I have an account or not. Uh, the odds on the number one overall pick are off the board everywhere. Everywhere they're off the board. I was going to try and do a C.J. Stroud plus 1,200 to be the number one overall pick. I was going to throw $100 on it, but apparently it's all off the board everywhere. So I'm rooting for C.J. Stroud to go number one. I got to sell these. This is uh, set number to 75. That's a yellow one, and that's number to 245 or 249. And then the rest, it's just you got the pink refractor. You got the base refractor. But, you know, I would say there's – maybe $150 here. But if he goes number one, it might be more. I don't know. But I'm also trying to sell other crap. Either... Uh, uh, uh. I actually got it to go through. I got it to go through. I got it. All right, watch this. Do I do this? Oh my God, I just won $2,500. Guys, I think I, wow. It won't even focus. It is the next day, guys. It's 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 actually early afternoon the next day, 1240 right now. Let's get an update on the odds. Let's see how well my bet is looking. There's actually, there's some, there was an Aaron Rodgers prop and it said Aaron Rodgers will win two Super Bowls with the Jets. And it's like, bro, Oh my goodness, would you look at that. Oh, I got great value last night getting plus 2,500. It's happened. Guys, I knew that I knew it was going to happen. I knew CJ Stroud would make a comeback. But yes, so I got CJ Stroud last night plus 2,500. It's down to plus 900. I still don't think it's going to happen, but I, I knew it was good value and I had to take it. Will Levis is still in second place. Bryce Young is still the heavy favorite. But that is some positive movement. I actually think that movement is mainly caused by people like me just saying this is such great value. You got to try it. I don't know why I have a little thing on the screen. But um, I just think it's from people like me saying thinking that it's good value. But take a look at this. 
Oh, th this is what I actually want. So this is a custom Lego set, Independence Hall. This thing, the bricking, the little arches, this thing's a beast. But unfortunately, it costs $1,800. It's 30,000 pieces. It is crazy. But I wanted to get this. I just... I just don't have the money for it on it. Well, I mean, I do have the money, but I'm just, I'm not, I can't really spend that kind of money on it. So I was thinking of doing some type of, that's actually really cool too, 173. It's a nice little, uh, it's a nice haunted house there. But what I was thinking of doing was buying two of these. So there's another Lego set. If I get two of these and then stack them on top of each other, I think that that might be the play. That might be my Lego project that I can do because it only costs 170 bucks, but it is shipped from probably some like Glogendong China or some crap. It costs like 90 bucks for shipping, but maybe I can get a little discount or something. Where does it ship from? They don't, they don't even say where it ships from, but if I get two of these, I can do a little, how tall is this thing? This is a big boy. I mean, this is 4,000 pieces if you buy two of them. 88 centimeters. Yeah, so 88 centimeters is like um, three and a half feet. More two, three feet, I think. And then if I get another one, it's like six feet. I want to make a behemoth tower. So maybe this will be my Lego project I can do for the camera. Uh, but yeah, what I really want is like they've got some crazy builds. I, I don't know where the other one is. Oh, they got a little bonus. Yeah, it, this costs like fifteen hundred bucks, or actually eighteen hundred or something. But it says two forty eight. But that that's just the building. When when you include it, it costs more. They've got some crazy builds. If you look at this, this is that Chinese website. That crap. Where is the? I mean, look at that thing. I mean, I would buy that. I, I just don't have the money. Um, You can see, this is what, yes, yes. Dude, this is a mansion. This is a gazebo mansion. It's better than the Taj Mahal. And it's a thousand bucks. You're gonna charge charge me a thousand bucks for it. And then they do that fake thing. Oh, it's 50% off. My ass. It's not, how did you come up with that number? How is it 50% off? It's 50% off all year round, I'm guessing, with these sites. That's how they do that. But how many pieces is this dude this thing is a beast it's an it's an impressive set man it, it's a nice mansion imagine getting this and pairing it with this and putting them like make a little mansions row this is technically not a mansion it's it's a hall but you can still make it out to be a mansion but i'll probably just end up getting the tower just, just because I, it's in my price range and I can get two towers and then make it taller than me. I mean, if I'm 5'10", I actually don't even think it might not even be taller than me. I don't know if I get two of them. Well, let's just see. Let, let's just, let's just, wait, I already have it in my cart. All right, let's, let's see. Let's see how much it costs. Are you joking? You just said I had it in my cart. And now you're going to take me back to the homepage. See, this is the problem with this. Let's add it to the cart and let's see how much your shipping costs from Glogendong. It's three thirty-eight for two of these things. See, that's the issue. It's 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 shipping straight from Glogendong, China. It's gonna cost sixty bucks. But I do think there's a discount code on it. Maybe I get free shipping with a discount. Three thirty-eight adding shipping. It's four hundred. Dude, I need to somehow see. I would rather you not show my password. Well, I guess. I need to somehow win that CJ Strout bet. That's what I need to do. Strawberry. Strawberry Dr. Pepper. So, yeah, I was at Target and they were just like, this apparently, I saw this on, I don't know, some online thing. I go to Target and the dude has like six of them left. He's unloading them. So I figure I might as well get it, try it. And this is the Strawberry Dr. Pepper. I haven't had... I've been mainly focused on all water, things like that. I do have Fresca, I guess. That's the other thing I drink. Let me try this. That's pretty good. Tastes like strawberry Starburst. That, that's what it tastes like, strawberry Starburst. But yeah, that's not bad. Um... But yeah, guys, I am live streaming tomorrow night. I'm doing the draft. Um, 
I do not think that, based off of what I've seen, uh, C.J. Stroud's going to go number one. I think there's been some bad interviews. There's been some stuff. But I will make some serious money if he does actually go number one. So that will be interesting. But yeah, guys, I mean, I've just been, I've been losing my mind. I have been losing my mind. I don't know what happened to me. Um, it seems to happen like progressively over time where you just start changing your behavior and changing it a little bit, a little bit, a little bit each day. And then it gets to the point to where you're, you don't even recognize yourself anymore. And I feel that's what's happened to me. So I, I, I don't know um, what's going on. I think I just got to get out of here, man. I, I just I can't keep doing this. There's just no way. This is not... I, I don't think we realize how bad social media is and things like that. I mean, it's great. You know, all the knowledge and stuff like that. But it's just the same thing over and over and over and over and over again. And... I don't know. So, I mean, listen, I, I'll probably do a channel update or something uh, relatively soon, but I, I don't know. I, it, it is not going well for me at all. So, I will be doing the draft tomorrow, and we will, I mean, we'll see who ends up going. It should be a, you know, the draft is a really good thing to live stream and react to, because I don't have to, like, give any play-by-play -play or anything like the other crap I was doing when I was trying to do like, you know, the college football playoff and stuff like that. So this will be a lot more digestible. I'll have Twitter pulled up. Hopefully that they don't spoil the picks. That's one of the big things. You know, we, we know that people get the picks early. We don't want them spoiled. We want to see it announced. So uh, I don't know how the um, how delayed it's going to be either. Maybe like seven or eight seconds. But uh, we will see what happens when it comes to that. But yeah, so this, <clears throat> you know, this is pretty good. I'm not going to lie. I need to drink, I don't really drink ca caffeine in the afternoon, but, um, I mean, I just haven't had anything like this in forever. You know, I just don't drink this anymore, but I had to get it because it was just, you know, these things probably sell out immediately. They got a nice little rare pink can. Yeah, these things are pretty nice, but, uh, guys, that is going to do it for this little video.